toe down. And let's start to tap the big toe down. Just the big toe down. So imagine your feet are your hands. Hi, Celine. Tapping the big toe down and down. So work those toe. But as you're working the toe, you're noticing that everything all up and down the feet, all at the bottom are getting woken up as well. It's not something we normally think about, yes? So tap the big toe down and down. That's right. And see funny things happening to your hands. And tap. Now all 10 toes back up. And then bring the little toe down. Just a little one. You might, want, you might need to do it slowly. Yeah, you might need to do it slowly if you've never done it and it's a bit weird. Yeah. And now, all 10 toes back up. Spread the toes out while we alternate. Big toe and little toe. Big toe and little toe. Big toe and little toe. <laughs> yes, I know. Big toe, little toe. Little toe, big toe. Big toe, little toe. Do it very slowly if it's quite new to you. And then, you know, understand why we're doing it. Because why is it hard? It should be as easy as moving our fingers. Yeah. So let's get them there. Now have a quick wiggle with these. Now all ten toes back up. Big toe down. Okay, we take our time to get that. Big toe is now down. A little toe down, the other three stay up. When I first learned this, I do that. <laughs> it took me about two or three weeks to get there. Some people longer, some people to get it the next time. Well done, now walk it out. Stretch. 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 Let's go stretch it out, guys. Stretch. Right over the balls of the feet, so get right over. Stretch out. Let the toes separate out. In five and four, three and two. Nice one. Step out nice and wide. Now we're going to turn sideways. Breathe in and breathe out. Swing and swing the arms and lift up. So bouncing off the knees down and up and then down. Swing. This is very, very relaxed. So just enjoy. Yeah. And up. Last one. Down and up. And reach up, guys. Hands behind your head. Release the chest into the heavens. Scoop the navel to the spine. Let's roll our way down. At the bottom here, gently swing side to side, releasing any tension you might be holding in your back. And then release the hands down to the floor. Inhale, bend the knees. Exhale, very slowly straighten the legs. As much as you can, inhale, bend the knees. Don't worry if you can't straighten completely. Exhale, slowly straighten. Follow, allow the gravity to pull your body forward. Inhale, bend the knees. Exhale, slowly straighten, hold the stretch, five, and four, three, and two. Now release, and the hands off the floor, scoop the navel to the spine, roll it up. Whew, shoulders back, guys, and back, and back. Let's take it out to the side, take it across, and two, and three. Hold it here, look up, making sure you can see your ceiling, and look down. Inhale, and then reach for the so spin from the waist, and reach for the corners, and slide your way down. Breathe in, pull the shoulders back. Breathe out, holding the leg tighter. Bend on some more. Can you get the leg body maybe closer? And then bending the opposite leg. For example, I'm holding onto my left leg, I'm bending my right leg, so vice versa. And then inhale, straighten the legs. Exhale, bend into the right leg again. Five, four, three, and two in the center. And roll your way up for using your abs. Three, two, shoulders back, guys. Four, three. Two, let's go the other side. Take it across. Two, three, hold it here, look up. See the ceiling so your chest is nice and open. And look down. And then lift up, take a little rotation, and then reach, and keep going, guys. Now, on this side, I'm holding on to my right side. You might be holding on to your left, that's okay. Inhale, pull the shoulders back, wrist straight in the arms. Exhale, bend the arms, and can you bring yourself closer? Don't worry if the knees are slightly bent. Inhale, exhale, bend the opposite leg. So I'm bending my left leg now, away from my body. And inhale, straighten the legs. Exhale, bend away from the body again. Three, and two, come to center, hold on to the ankles, guys. Inhale, bend, exhale, slowly straighten. Inhale, bend, using the arms to help you now to intensify the stretch. Last one, slowly straighten the legs and find the stretch, five. Four, three, two, release the arms on the floor and roll it up, guys. And shoulders back. Let's pick up the pace. Two counts. One and two and flat back for two and down for two. Center, hand in the middle of the chest into a flat back. Open and close. One more slow. Open on the same side. And now double time. You open, close, open and close. Two more. Open and close. One more. Hold the stretch, guys. Five and four. Three and two, come back to center and roll your way up. And shoulders back and back, the other side. Take it across and two and flat back for two. 
and down for two center of the chest you open slowly and close slowly and open slowly moving from the waist double time and open close open and close two more open nice last one hold it here five and four three and two now walk out to your uh, uh, your mat we forward and back forward and back right away right away guys come on and forward and back and just work your way in go forward and back soften the elbows now nice last one hold it here one leg is up and press the toes pointing down and press and press shoulders away from the ears it's eight seven six five yes four three hold it here slowly knee into the chest slowly send the leg back exhale to the chest double time it comes breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in do we have four more here we go exhale you can always put the other knee down but you are all fine here this is only the beginning hold the knee to the chest guys and now pop and pop can you try to touch it to your chest and exhale 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 shoulders over the wrist guys eight seven six five four three two and then back to that downward send it back in the downward dog and release the leg in the air the very first split stretch so it's gonna feel a little tighter but that's okay and then just split the legs further apart so just now when you contract you're shortening and contracting the torso now you give the torso a chance to lengthen out and five pulse the leg towards your head four next time you come to plank you bring the knee to the tricep guys meet me here in plank now this leg same leg you touch the knee to the tricep and send it so open exhale knee to the tricep inhale back exhale knee to the tricep inhale one more breathe out to the tricep double time exhale inhale breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in breathe out four more here and four shoulders and arms are burning already that's right two guys hold it here and pulse the knee to touch the tricep squeeze squeeze making sure you're not leaning over to the other side yeah squeeze 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 and squeeze it's four and hold it here send it back to the downward dog and split stretch the leg is back in the air posing up and up next up you're gonna take it to plank and take this knee to opposite armpit guys in five and four join me three and two into plank and the knee take across opposite elbow inhale send it back slow exhale opposite elbow inhale back exhale opposite elbow inhale stay in plank last one double time guys here we go breathe out breathe in breathe out breathe in exhale inhale breathe out tap it down four more exhale rolling from the waist well done three more come on and two more <laughs> last one hold it to your shoulders now pulse and pulse and squeeze and squeeze it's eight seven six prepare for side plank four three two shoot the leg out in front of you so the leg is across the body you send the leg across the chest open the arms up shoulder play pulse and press and press and press here's eight seven six and five well done four three now keep that leg in front of you lying down and the inner thigh squeeze and press and press that's it and press so inner thigh really turn out the leg the turn out external rotation so good for the inner thigh and the inner thigh goes up to your pelvic floor lower ab yeah press and press it's eight and seven and now can you get right onto your sides and can you release the arm into the air four three two guys hold it up here hold it up five four three two now big circle Shh. and big circle are the toes pointing at the floor the whole time and big circle it's four and three well done everybody and two and now hold it up here hold it and pulse pulse leading with your heel pulse 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 and pulse it's eight seven it's beginning to burn a little four three two hold on and circle the other way big one the leg is almost out 90 degrees from the hips sorry about the angle but this is the clearest one you can really see the leg is far out in front of you two more Shh. 
Now hold the leg up to the highest point. Now pulse up and up and up, up. It's eight, seven, six, five. That's right, four, three, two. Hold on and come back up. So on your hands and bring the leg back in. So you are ready for clam. Now we are back on the same arm. You open up for four and come in. So from inner side to outer side, you open up and come in. Side plank, you're up for two and in. Next time you go up, stay up, extend, bend, and in. And open, extend, bend, and in. Two more, open, extend, bend, and in. Last one, open, hold it, pose the leg towards your head, and squeeze, and squeeze. Oh my God, go squeeze. It doesn't look hard, man. Go squeeze and squeeze. It's eight, seven, don't have to be high, just as high as you can. Four, three, leave the leg up, sit down, and back up. So sit down and back up. That's right. So down and up. Again, the leg doesn't have to be high. Just keep it off the floor. Four more down and up. Three more down and up, guys. You can hear it. Two more. Shh. Last one, guys. Hold it up here. Up and press the leg towards your head again. Go squeeze. Squeeze. Yes, I know. And squeeze is eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, listen up, elbow plank. <laughs> so onto your elbows. This is where your cage, this is where you take a break, guys. This is your break. Now tap one knee down and up. The other knee down is like walking. One knee and the other knee. And four. Now if that feels good, you can then start to glue both legs together. Both knees down and up. But the bump is not going up and down. So scoop the navel to the spine, bring the knee down. Exhale. Down and up. And down. Four more. Exhale. This is where you, this is your break. This is where you catch your breath. Touch your knee down. Touch your knee down. Two more. Down. Last one, guys. Hold down to the plank and back on your hands. And onto that downward dog. Shake out your head. Well done, everybody. So miraculous. You are onto. You are ready for the other side. And this time you come through the plank. You lift the other. Press. And press. So this is the leg that is here just now. Yeah, this is the leg that is up just now. So now you come up, it's the same leg up. And up, and press, and press. For four, three, hold down. Now slowly knee to the chest, and slowly back. Exhale to the chest, inhale back. Exhale to the chest, inhale back. One more guys, exhale. Now double time, pull it in and back and in and back. That's why I go in and back. Four more, sorry, I'm just gonna switch off some of the things so that it doesn't keep popping up. Nice, two more, in. Hold it to your breast guys, hold it and now pulse, pulse, press. Yes, put the navel towards my pick up this leg, press. That is your own leg guys, not any weights or dumbbells, it's your leg, four. Three, two, you gotta break guys, downward dog, well done. Downward dog, catch your breath, lift the leg back in the air and stretch it out into split stretch. That should feel really good because just now we shorten and contract the torso, now you lengthen. So press up, up. Next time you come forward, the knee is gonna open. Three, two, guys, come through to play knee, open out to the side and send it back. Like a crab, knee out to the side, try to go to the tricep, knee out to the side, and back and up. Now double time. Take it up and back. Guys, don't be discouraged. No more playing after the warm up. And out. Four more. I know it's harder. I know it's hard. That's why you're here. And two. Now hold the knee to the tricep. Hold it and pulse the knee to the tricep. Go squeeze. Squeeze. Come on. Exhale. Well done. You got this downward dog again in a break. Three, two. Well done, everyone. Send the leg back. Downward dog and pick the leg up. Woo! And pulse. Pulse. Now, next time we come through, we're gonna twist that. Gonna get, go to opposite elbow. In five, four. Meet me in plank. Three, two, guys. Hum in plank. Take the knee across. Open back up. So cross. Open back up. Well done. Cross. Open back up. And cross. We're ready for double time, guys. Here we go. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Do your core. Your whole abs is picking up that leg. Up and look. Exhale, inhale, two more up. Guys, hold it out across, now pulse, pulse, pulse. Don't worry how high you are. When I first learned this, I think my toes on the floor like this. Yeah, so you will start somewhere. This is where I was 
And as you get stronger, you come up four, three, two, release the leg across the body, open up, and now lift, and lift. Your body, your legs are like an L shape. And lift, and lift, yes, for four, three, two, now keep that leg in front of you, simply lie down, and you're ready up. Very smooth, guys, very smooth. <laughs> and up. So with me, the transition is always smooth, yeah. Nice, because if it gets complicated, it complicates me too much. And up, and up, and four up. Three up, well done. And two. Now hold it up, guys. Hold it in the highest point there. And hold, squeeze your pelvic floor, now circle. Shh. Can you point the toe to the floor? And if you're feeling very strong, can you get up right onto your side? Right onto your side, so not on your butt cheek. And two more. And now hold at the highest point and pulse. Pulse, pulse it up, go pulse. So let me turn this music lower in case you can't hear me. Go pulse and pulse. People going, we can't hear you, fine. For four, three, hold on here, guys. Circle the other way. Do you remember which way you did? Circle the other way. Right on your butt, the side of your butt. Try to get there at least. Try not to be resting on the butt cheek, yeah? Really turn out the leg. It's targeting that really weak bit in that inner side there. Hold on and pulse up to finish. Pulse and pulse and pulse. It's eight, seven. Turn out, turn out, turn out. And four, three, two. Nice one. Come back in. And now back on your hands. You lift up to the clam and back in. So just now the inner thigh. Now we're attention back to outer thigh. Yeah. So you're into like a side, weight, side planks and down. And clam. Squeeze both butt cheeks. Now add the leg, so it's up, and lift, and down, and back in, yes, open, and lift, and down, don't worry about the height, don't worry about the height, yeah, don't worry about the height, yes, everyone, we can all get the leg up, yeah, here we go, double time, open, straighten, down, and in, open, straighten, just two more, and open, straighten, down, last one guys, we hold at the top leg, pulse the leg towards your head, go squeeze, 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 eight, seven, six, five, four, three, hold on and sit down and press back up, and sit down and press back up, there's a lot of core, sit down, and if you don't worry about the leg, just let it go low if you need to, but just try not to touch to the floor, four more, just four more, yes, and up. It's a crazy side plank, I tell you. <laughs> you don't think you get to do side plank on the knees in my class without some challenge. Nice. Last one, guys. Hop. And then leg is back up. Pose towards your head again. It's your final challenge. Press, 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 and press. It's four, three, two. Nice one. Come through. On to down, downward dog. Walk the hands and feet towards each other. Four, forward, fold. Oh my God. Relax your legs completely. Let everything dangle. Now clasp your hands behind your back. And then keep the knees bent, keep your necks relaxed, and just stretch your arms. Ooh, not liking that. <laughs> bend the knees, bend the legs, and stretch your arms. Stretch your legs if you want. Ah, oh, five, four, three, two. Nice one. Release arms, and let's roll our way up and reach for our cushion and our ball. I have cut the sequence short because I add a little bit on the other side yeah? So it's your chair, you're gonna be facing the bar or your kitchen table, your counter, whatever. I'm gonna tip you up, so, and I'm gonna be quite far away from the screen so you can all see the whole thing. Well done, everybody, yeah? So here we go. So from here, you have the cushion or your bowl. Some of us use squeeze toys. <laughs> the bear come in handy sometimes. So just something that can offer you some resistance when you squeeze it, yeah? So a puffy cushion is nice. You're facing your back, and you're up on your toes, and down the heels. Up on the toes, find this vertical straight line, and look. Up the toes, and back down, four more, up, and look. So you're not, there's no overarching down, and now hold it up, now press, and press, yeah? You can see you're trying to keep the body as upright as you can. When you start to get tired, you will want to do this. That's why we're holding on to avoid that, yeah? And press, and press, that's it. Go press, and press. And right here, go press. Now, once you get down, you're only going up and down an inch, yeah? Try not to go come up too much, come on. And drop, I know, drop, and drop. 
Can you get right up on tippy toe if you can? Yeah, drop. Here it's a bit too easy, guys. Come on. Up, drop. And for four. And three. As usual, we're going to add one drop, squeeze. Drop, squeeze. Drop and squeeze. Anna, did you miss me? Drop and squeeze. Drop and squeeze. And drop. Nice one. Now we're going to double time. Drop, squeeze. Drop, squeeze. Drop, squeeze. Yeah. Now, don't worry about facing the bar. Just drop, squeeze. That's why we're holding on both hands because it gets a bit challenging. And drop. But we're going to try to face you because I want to see you guys. Drop, squeeze. Drop, squeeze. For eight, seven is one move, guys. Woo -hoo -hoo. And four. And three. And two. Hold on here all the way down. All the way up slowly. Yeah. Four counts four. Three, two, one. Four counts up four. Three, that's a challenge. So when you come up, you don't go to the rear. Yeah, so you really come all down. And up, up, up. Just two more, come on, I know. That's yes, surprising, right? Down, and up, taking it with me up. up. Last one, guys, all the way down. Halfway up, hold. All the way down, halfway up, hold. You know exactly what I meant. All the way down. Halfway up, hold, all the way down, halfway hold. Two more, all the way down, halfway up, hold. Last one, all the way down, halfway up, hold the arms up, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Come on, halfway up, get down there, squeeze. Halfway up, not three quarter way up. For squeeze, can you get those toes super high? Come on, heels, heels. Now let's go double hand, squeeze, 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 squeeze. It's eight, seven, six. Now it's another eight. Come on, eight, seven, six, four, three, two. Remove, but keep it close by. Keep it very close by and step back and step forward. Step back and step forward. Nice. You don't need a man, but I'm ripping people's floor apart and I feel bad. And forward. Split squat and the so running, running lunge and back. Two more. Shh. And back. Last one. Hold it here. Go bro. And we're back to that vertical line we talk about. Yeah, my head, shoulders back to the bottom, knees one straight line. Go press. I know you all know this, and I know it's also very hard. Well done, and press. We catch our breath, four and three. Here we go, guys, all the way down, halfway up. All the way down, halfway up. All the way down. This is why we hold on, guys. All the way down, halfway up. Not making sure it's not behind you like this, that's too easy. It's right under you. Four more. All down with arms. All the way down, halfway. Two more. Anyway, last one, guys. Halfway and pulse. Shake it out, guys, shake it out. Oh my God. And now we're gonna get to the nitty gritty and we move on, yes. It's eight, seven. Remember, Brogue, guys, we use, we do weights with this. Three, two, all down, everybody. All the way down. An inch up. All the way down, two centimeters up. All down, a little up. All down, four more, just four more. Come on, I know it burns. All down, two inch. Last two. Guys, Glenna, get right down. What are you doing? I can see you. Hold it here. Now, abs, contract, release. Contract, release. Beyonce, pump, release. Contract, release. Contract. Release, contract, release, contract. Guys, let's go double time to finish your press. Pump, pump, and pump. Go press, all in the abs, guys. So press, press. It's eight, seven, shh. Now remember where you put your thing. And three, and two. Oh my God, bring it in. Behind the knee now. You're, you're not as close to your chair. You bring the one step away. The leg, <laughs> the leg that is behind, will stay behind and you are press and up now making sure you're on both elbows or both hands that you're not going one and one higher than the other you're completely level completely parallel now listen and up now have a look when you go up you, you plie the bottom leg when you lift your squat you lift and squat and lift and squat and lift and squat yes now if you can't lift the leg any higher without hurting the back then just keep the leg high you don't have to lift it and lift and squat. Squat the bottom leg, guys. Yeah, when you squat the bottom leg, you lift the leg higher. Not the other way around. <laughs> Four. Well done. Three. And two. And now hold it here, guys. Are we ready? Double time. Go drop press. Drop lift. 
drop lift, drop lift, drop lift, drop lift. Yeah, that's clear. Drop lift, drop lift. Here's eight, seven, six. Let your legs work. And four, three. Hold down on your toes. Carry on lift. Oh, that's optional. If you are, <laughs> if you just just had enough, keep stay on your heels. Let's lift drop. Go eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Come on down. Slow squeeze. Slow squeeze. Slow squeeze. Slow squeeze. Four, four. Belly button in. Three. If you're quite high, keep the leg absolutely behind the supporting leg. Not in the same line. I'm really working. Well done, Katie. Two. Hold it here. One squeeze, one lift. Squeeze and lift. Squeeze and lift. Squeeze and lift. Nice. The more you feel it in the back, the more you gotta suck the stomach in. That is what's gonna make this work effective. Four. Shh. It's not just glue, it's very much a core abs work. Yeah? Last one. Try to imagine you're trying to break whatever you're squeezing. Like squeeze hard and lift. 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 And lift. At the drop. Drop and lift. Drop. And draw. So you're like splitting the legs in different directions. Press and press. Here's eight, seven. Lift drop, lift drop. Yes, four, three. Hold down everyone onto toes if you can. Lift drop, drop. Carry on. Up and up. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold down, point the toes. Turn up. Parallel. <laughs> Turn now. The challenging part, hips are the To modify, come up a bit higher. But your leg is still very much behind. In a way, almost harder, yeah? Because here, yeah, so if you really need to motivate, come up a bit higher to release the supporting leg, to release, but still keep that leg behind you, very much behind you. Four more, parallel. Three more, turn out, parallel. Two more, turn out. Now stay on the turn out, go lift. Lift, and lift that side, butt cheek there, go lift. This is when in, in our swan leg, Prince Charming comes behind the princess, go lift. And lift, guys, it's eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Hold on, tiny circle behind you. Oh my God, don't drop the leg, just circle it. Don't drop the leg. And I'm beginning to feel a bit numb, I hope you are as well. Four, three, guys, wait here, big circle. So to modify, if you're a bit higher, the big circle, you see, my leg is still very much behind my working leg. It never comes here. Never comes here, so right behind you, even though you're standing up. Three. Oh, the butt cheek's working hard. Well done, guys. Hold it here. Have a few seconds, breathe. Circle the other way. Shh. Tiny, yeah. To stand up is to release the supporting leg. It doesn't make work any easier. Yeah, yeah, squeeze. Four, four, three. Hold it, big circle. Making sure the knees never come side to side. Working leg always behind the standing leg. And four, I know what I'm on. Three, making sure the arms are bent evenly, not open. And two, and hold on here. Five, four, three, two. Now stand up. So, stand up, still holding. So you're like a T shape. You go forward into a T and come back up. The leg is still working. Forward into a T, come back up. Yes, forward into a T, back up and up. Forward into a T. Just four more like that. Yes. Forward into a T. Anna, I missed you. Four. <laughs> hey, well done. Two more. And we're going to meet in a horizontal line. Glenn, I take that leg up when your body come down. Come on. Yes, exactly. Take the leg up when your body come down. Last one. Let's hold here, guys. Hello. Now, plie. And drop. Oh, drop. This is it. That's it. And drop. And drop. Here's eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, open out. So my hip, one next to each other, all facing the floor. Now everything facing forward. And then the work straight away onto the side. Yeah? Lift. And then bring the hand behind your head. So this, when the elbow's pointing in the ceiling, you can feel right away your back is working. And lift. Modification, yeah, lift. But to be honest, I don't think it's easier at all. It just makes it easier for the supporting leg, yeah? Four. Three, well done everybody, slide it forward, slide it back, slide it forward. All ladies who ever done it with me in the gym, we have weights behind our knees for this one. You guys have it easy now, forward, four more. Exhale forward, inhale back. Three more, exhale forward, inhale, well done, well done, two more, yes. 
Ah, last one. Keep it in front of your breast and lift to the heavens. Squeeze. So outer thigh and glute. Lift. Contract. Go press and press. Pull the belly button in. Your lower back should be completely protected by your glute and your abs. Four, three, two, double pop. Forward twice. Pop it back twice. And forward. Forward. No rush. Back. Back. Forward twice. And back twice. One more time. Forward. And next time it comes forward, you remove the hole. Thank God. Now slow kick. And slow kick. And breathe out. And breathe out. Here is four and three. Now flex the foot. We're just gonna flick eight times. Go eight, seven, flick and flick and four, three, two. Now point A back to point B. Slow, slow. Right up the side. Go slow, slow. Yeah, hold it here, guys. Slow stretch, slow press, slow <laughs> fireplace, and slow press. One more slow stretch, slow press. One more guys. Now two more trips. Point A to point B, back to point A. And up. Um, well done, enjoy. You can do it absolutely slow, absolutely low, that's fine, but don't give up. And point A, back to point B. Yeah. Minding the journey in the middle. That's the most fun part. A to B, B to A. Oh, one, this is your last time. Huh? Make it perfect, take it back. Back to the side, yes, yeah, 16 poses to finish guys. Oh my God, and press. And press. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Oh, bring it in. Figure of four, guys. Now, the other side, while you're stretching, have a look. You have your squeezy, or I have here, yeah, I have an array of things. I have like a jumper, or like a, you know, anything. Now, while you're stretching, instead of all that again, we're going to go to turn our first position. Yeah, into this inner thigh. So, but again, very short, and then we go back in here. Yeah, you don't really need to see my head, really. So, <laughs> well, onto the other side. Oh, you move the chair, you move your computer, whatever. Everyone get naked. Now, if you haven't done the bound with me for a while, let's work our way into our turn out. So, turn out, parallel, out, parallel from the hip socket. Turn out, actually, for physio, turn out doesn't exist. It's not about stretching. Turn out involves it turn out involve your whole glute, your whole abs, your whole, whole back, yeah? It's that whole thing. And then by moving this whole leg, all the abs and all your glutes involved. It's a very, very intricate, interesting move. Last two out, back, last one, hold the turn out, lift up, squeeze your heels together. Let's drop. Yes, drop, yeah. And press, and press. Yeah, really vertical straight down here. Go press. You'll find certain bits of this a lot easier than parallel leg. Yeah? Press and press. It's eight, seven, six, and press. Yes, four, three, and to stay down, now press wrap up and wrap. Wrap it out. So tiny move. You're not flapping. You go out to further out, further out. You press. So right away, oh, and press. Yeah, very, very safe here. Go press. Press. Yes, Celine, I know you are on the flat turn out. Yes, well done, guys. Nice one. And it's eight, seven, six, yes, five. Super high on the heels. Three and two. Hold it here. Now one drop, one wrap. One drop. Basically the same move, but now on the turn out. Drop and press for four. Press three. Press and two. And now double time. Drop, press. Drop, press. Drop, press. Drop, press. Katie is doing a nice first position. Yeah, if you want to join, go drop press. And Andrea there as well. Drop press. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Starting to burn. And hold it here all the way down. How the way up. Nice. So this is easier than the parallel all the way down. Always. See, yeah, it's a little, little easier than when you're parallel. Heels together all the way down. Yeah, all the way. And Glenna is an expert. She's doing all this without holding on, man. And, and all the way up. Just two more. All the way down. Shh. And oh. So that's all up this pelvic floor in the thigh. Last one. Halfway up. Hold it. All the way down. Halfway up. Hold it. All the way down. Not three quarters of the way up. Halfway up. Hold it. All the way down. Come on, come on, guys. Halfway. Just last two. Last two, I promise. All the way down. Glenna, I know you were lower. Halfway up. 
<laughs> one more all the way down freeze and press and press yes press and press Ooh, my butt and press and press it's eight seven six five that's right four three two now come back to parallel so you come back to the hip width apart and step back and forward that's right so the legs are not together they're hip width apart go back forward back and forward tap it back and forward into this split squat perfect four don't be afraid step right back and two Shh. hold it here go drop 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 and drop eight four three let's get going guys all the way down halfway up all the way down halfway up all the way down nice the challenge here being this leg is a bit more tired so if you have a tendency this might happen yeah because the glue switching off keep that out all the way down halfway up. keep that glue working the knee points into the second and the third toe last one guys halfway up you have tears in your eyes just let it go now pose like me and pose and pose and pose hold on if you need to both hands if you need to it's eight yeah seven even just fingers and press four three let's get down all the way down one inch up all down inch up all down inch up all down you see that knee is already under the hip not here here is far too easy come on here is far too easy all down inch up four more all down inch up you can always tell by looking down if you can't see your leg is too far two more two more come on down inch up last one hold it here and now contract release contract release all right contract release yeah contract oh. if you ever see beyonce do this again you know how much work she's doing contract two more slow contract as last one now let's pump and pump and pump and pump. i know this leg is on fire come on pump and pump just the eight more it's eight shh, shh, and shh. it's four three two oh hold on bring the leg back and here's the ball and lift and lift yes and lift now if you're quite high in a way being high is kind of i find it even harder because being high doesn't make the work any less it just releases the standing leg yeah because the working leg still has to be behind you look still has to be very much behind the supporting leg it's never in front never side by side it's behind and now can we add the squat go drop lift drop lift drop lift drop lift so drop lift drop lift nice now if you have a tendency to out the back when you lift because the glutes tired suck that stomach in like your life depend on it and bend the leg as you lift the top leg bend the leg as you lift the top leg squat and lift yeah yeah exactly squat as you lift so you're pulling the legs in opposite direction and four more three more and two now hold it here double time guys press drop lift drop lift drop lift eight seven six five oh my god four three two hold on onto your toes carry on lift and drop lift drop lift drop lift it's eight seven shoulders pulling back and four three two come down and now point the toes turn out parallel the challenge here being the hips are staying down it's very tempting to do this you see both my elbows down yeah so you know you're not going onto your side turn out parallel my both hips are winking at the floor turn out so if you're quite high in a way it's harder because you've got to work harder to get the leg behind last two now double time for four it's out back out back two more out come on guys last one hold it here now press up 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 four four three hold it here tiny circle shh, shh, shh. very small very small so nothing but the hamstrings and the glutes four three hold on big circle big circle nothing else move just the oh my god if i'm doing this guys you're doing this with me <laughs> four more and three whew, two let this meet me up here circle the other way very small but tiny you see nothing else is moving you're just using just using all the butt including this line down the bottom there all the side that's three two circle large same direction 
circle and four three come on guys almost there two hold it up and now start to set up well done again so you see it's still behind you you're hinging forward and coming back up you see this doesn't switch off so you bring the leg with you when you come forward and keep the leg behind you when you stand up yeah and the leg never never come down that's it so all down so Glenna imagine your head to the knee is one straight line and you're like a seesaw hinging from the supporting leg that's it so you take the back leg with you when you come, bring the body down bring the leg up and vice versa two more guys let's make it perfect Shh, nice Oh, there you go, last one. That's perfect. Hold it here. Now drop and drop. Plie or squat, whichever you prefer to think about. It's eight, seven, underside, your top side working. Four, three, two. Open, open, open. Oh my God, that's nice. And now piss. <laughs> so everything is facing the floor. Now everything face the front and the attention shift out to the side. And lift, and lift. And four. Three, well done, everybody, slightly forward. Nice, nice. Now, if the hips are not very open, you might find yourself with less fine. Well, you know, just because you're lower doesn't mean you're working any less. And if you're able to go higher to feel the work, then go for it. Yeah. We will start somewhere when my hips were still quite tight. I think I was here. Yeah. So, you know, but as long as you're not swinging up and down, zap it in. Two more. Exhale. And bring the hand behind your head. Point the elbow to the heaven. Hold it here, now pulse up, 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 that's it, up, to the heaven, to the heaven, to the heaven. It's eight, like a clan, it's a bit like in the beginning, that clan, you have four, three, hold on, pop twice, and back twice, Shh. forward, forward, and back, back, Shh. forward, forward, and back, back, last one, forward, forward, and next time you take it forward, remove finally, slow kick, Slow kick, we call it devil pace, kick and kick. And the height doesn't matter as long as it's your highest, as long as you are working hard, doesn't matter if it's here. As long as you're not just saying, oh, but Grace, I'm working hard, but you're not, yeah? Now everyone flex the foot, flick it in, in, and flick and flick. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Well done, everybody. Now point A, back to point B, slow enjoy the journey it's challenging i know very challenging yeah well done hold it here stretch and release use your breath inhale exhale two more inhale exhale guys last one now two more journey and we're done yeah forward enjoy this middle bit here yeah that's a real chunk and back 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 yeah because it's also got okay this bit here i'm ready we yeah there you go yeah and slowly back back this is it just let's do this one yes well done well done everybody now 16 lift to finish and lift i can tell you my glutes completely switch off now what's working is here that's the only bit that's working and eight seven six five four three two oh my god put it down and go to figure four I am on fire now, everyone. We're on the floor now. <laughs> Do not despair. <laughs> we're on the floor now. So just angle the camera. We're not going to come up anymore. <laughs> going to stay down for the rest of the weekend. <laughs> no. On to some push up because our arms had really quite a nice long breakers. So, <laughs> face. So now the narrow one, your elbows going to the rib cage, tricep and bicep. Really, really try to not have it go out. Okay. It's challenging, I know, but <laughs> when is that ever a problem? So shift yourself, your shoulders shift right over the wrist, chest between the hands, and go down for two. And now don't let me uh, patronize you. If you are nice and strong, go for it, toes, yeah? And down for two, and up for two, and down for two. Glenna, look at that form, gorgeous. Well done, everybody, down for two, and up for two. Exactly, Andrea, wow, she's on her toes, man. Well done, everybody. Even if you're in the box, the spine is straight, the elbows in. You're down for two. And now double time, guys. Eight of these. Down and up. Inhale. Exhale. The tighter you suck the summer in, the more you squeeze your butt, the lighter you are. Three more. Shh. Two more. Nice. Hold it halfway. Hold. Now the elbows wrap in and in. 
elbows in and in. Go squeeze, hello, squeeze into the armpit. It's eight, seven, six, five. Shoulders away from the ears. Hold down and pulse, 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 pulse for four, three, two, nice one, come back. Now into a nice puppy pose. So bring the bum right over your knee and start to walk your hands up. Oh yeah. And then we come onto our front. <laughs> so some back and we go, we're gonna finish with abs. Well done everybody. Yeah, yeah, welcome to the Saturday morning that power, I call it power brunch. So we're on Sphinx pose, nice and relaxing <laughs> fireplace. Nice and relaxing the legs, just as wide as your mats. You see the Sphinx outside pyramids? Elbows right under the shoulders, try not to bring it in. Yeah, so from here you lift one arm, put it back. Lift the other. The back has to work, otherwise you, yeah. So, but you're not leaning at all, nothing move. You keep up, put it back, and up. Yeah, you go, it's a bit creepy. While you're doing that, we have done core like this. Yeah, we have done core, yeah. Either in my class or somewhere else. And this is the same principle. But you're using the muscles on your back, yeah? So up and tap down and reach up. Well done. And minimum, minimum swinging. No swinging either side. Just two more. Now hold it up. Doesn't matter which side it is. Now press back and back. Open out your back. Use the muscles on your back. My back is working so much, even my waist can feel it. Well done, everyone. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, now hold down, release the other arm so your body come down slightly and carry on lifting up and up. Belly button in, hits eight, seven, six, five, yes, four, three, two, bring yourself in back to that sphinx. Shoulder, the elbows right under the shoulders. Try not to squeeze it in. I know all the tricks because I cheat all the time. So stay up and turn. Sometimes I think that gyms and clubs hire me because I can spot the cheese. Turn the other way. Because I do it so much. Now guys, right, you've done it on one side, you know what it's like. you got to really get the glutes on and work the shoulder blades and back. Now the other arm. Up. Sorry, the other side. And press. And press. And press. Nice and calm. We have one look at the, cam at the, at the screen and you can look back down to your mat. It's eight, seven. Yeah, Glenn, look at that form. Yes, keep the shoulders away from the ears, guys. Hold on and release the other arm. So you're gonna come down quite considerably and press. If you're carrying any injuries or getting really tired, keep this opposite fingertips on the floor, this opposite hand, and press for eight, seven. Shoulders away from the ears. Four, three, two, hold on. And then come in now, hands under your forehead. So you're picking, your elbows are up towards the heavens. You're using your shoulder blade to pick up your arms but your head is heavy into your hands. Now lift up and up. So it's the shoulder blades that's lifting the whole thing up. Shoulder blades and lift. Shoulder blades together. Two more. Hold it up and pulse. Pulse. Your neck is heavy. Your head is heavy in your hands. This is hard, guys, yeah? And for eight, seven, elbows to the heavens, to the heavens. Come on, four, three, two, come down. Toes touching heels out. Give yourself a quick wiggle. Ooh, what was that? And one more round, and then we're gonna roll over onto our backs. Some core, and we're done, yeah. Well, that Andrew, I love the close up. I love how you're so smiley. Now, here we go. So, you see the neck is long. Yeah, keep the neck nice and long. Now, it's the shoulder blades that lift up and keep lifting up. Yeah, there you go. So, up and low. Up. Shoulders are away from the ears. The shoulder blades coming together, not lifting up to the neck. Yeah, coming together behind you, but not towards your neck. If this is far too challenging, bring the arms by your side like a cactus and lift up from here. Yeah, but I think you can all do the challenging one. Yeah. And now double time, go lift, lift, hand lift, neck is long. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Oh, lie down again. Oh, toes are touching, heels out, and we're going out once more, guys. Now, very carefully, very carefully, just simply roll onto your back. Yeah, onto the core. A very short, 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 but effective sequence, and then I have to let you go. <laughs> so, we're up. We're all so far so familiar. So far so good. Yeah, all the spine is on the floor. 
head behind, hands behind your head. This is the whole thing doesn't take about three, four minutes. Yeah, very, very short. Because it's very effective. I don't think we can do it for long anyway. So roll down to the point of challenge. You will know the one. Down to where you can't hold anymore. Whole spine is on the floor. And just up an inch, down an inch, a few, a bit, a few bits here. Get a sense of the heaviness of your abs. The whole abs is pressing into the floor to stabilize you. Yeah. Nice one. Moving from the hips. And four. Three. Now hold on. Circle one leg. Oh my god! <laughs> now once the leg go out, make sure the hips are not swinging. Starting on tiny circles. And then start to go wide. Making sure, be honest, you are not sinking one hip over. They are not tipping the body over. Everything is still on your mat. Hold the leg out to the side. Five, four, three, two. Reverse the circle. Ah! You see what I mean? We're not going to do it for very long because <laughs> you can't. In another three circle. Another two circle. Come on, everyone. And one. Hold the leg out to the side. Now crunching up. And up. And up. And up. It's eight. Seven. Six. Can you get the leg wider? Four. Three. Two, quick hug into a ball. So hug the knees to the chest. Keep the head and shoulders off the floor. Oh my God, now we got the other side and we're done. Then you're done, well done. Now hands behind the head, send the legs back out. Well done everybody, good luck. The other side. Starting very small. And then just gradually widen, but don't lift the leg up high. Yeah. You keep the leg low. That's where it's most effective. And don't worry about the size yet. Yeah, just the size of the circle. Just take it to where you can before your hips tip over. Hold it out to the side. Five, four, three, two, circle the other way. Press the navel to the spine. Press the whole spine onto the floor. Come on, everybody. Yes. Another three circles. Another two. Oh my God. Hold it out to the side. And crunching up. And up. And up. Final 16. Come on, crunch. And crunch. You got eight more and we are stretching. It's eight. Seven, one leg in front of you, one leg out to the side. Four, three, two. Oh, hug in. Well done, everybody. Hug the knees in. Now I'm gonna angle. So stay in line. We are gonna stretch now. If you need to leave, now's a good time, but I'm gonna keep it open. Well done, Katie. Thank you. Nice, thank you. So now if you're staying with me, yeah, you're on your back. Uh now just hug the knees. Bring the arms out wide, knees and knees at 90 degrees on top of your hips. Now very carefully, very carefully, over to one side, turning the head across the other way. You can even, you can even drop the one leg first, so it's less stress. Remember, we just did some back bend sequences. Yeah, so very, very mindful. Secure both backs and both shoulders on the floor. You did so well, guys. Well done. Now, whilst, whilst a twister like so, start to straighten the top leg. Uh, I hope you can see, yeah, you can start straight in the top leg. You can reach the ankle, reach the ankle. If you can't, just leave it. And flex and point the foot. And then maybe try to reach either the ankles or the calf. And then pull the legs further towards your body for a hamstring stretch. And now swipe the leg in front of your face. Slowly take yourself to a straddle. This is why I lie down to another angle. Well done, everybody. Straddle. Don't worry about how wide you are. Now this is where I started, I think. But really focus on the external rotation so your heels are to the heavens. And five. It should be very comfortable as long as you just forget what it should look like. If it's really, really awkward for you, go to happy baby. So you bend the knees into your armpit and hold on to your foot. And then slowly bringing the legs in together, bend the knee at the, at the, at the hip, uh, above the hip and go over to the other side. Again, slow, slow. So maybe dropping one leg first and the other, minding your back. So good everyone. I'm all numb, I don't know about you guys. Now straighten the top leg and then reaching for maybe the calf or maybe you can hold the ankle. Maybe you just reach your thigh or maybe you just... Yeah, maybe you don't want to hold. You just want to leave the leg out there. And then flex and point the foot. And then using the arms to pull the leg further towards your body. And then flex and point the foot. It's a hamstring stretch. With a twist. <laughs> and then release the hole. Swipe the leg in front of your face. Go to straddle number two. 
it, because we did so many really deep core, all these lifts has so much power flow. That's why like the, the second inner thigh position, second position stretch is really, it's really, or any hip opener. So happy baby is a more gentle version. Yeah? Everyone, nice. Now, just for a bit of fun, <laughs> try it. Start to lift up and then put the legs down. <laughs> or come into frog legs and then lift up. Yeah. Otherwise, you stay in the shadow, and I'm sure my dancer friends are in front of Instagram is having a laugh right now. Lift up and slowly put legs down. Well done, now come in. <laughs> well done, so double, double figure four. <laughs> Sometimes I, I like to add little fun things. So, you are looking for the parrot, the, okay, so you're facing your edges of your mat. You want your shin to be as parallel to the mat as possible. So it's not like a cross-legged. You're not trying to tuck it to your groin. You're trying to get the shins as parallel to the floor as possible, like a four, figure four. And then press forward, it's a glute stretch. Yeah. So you're not trying to go to a cross-legged. You're not trying to bring the heel to your groin. You're trying to leave it out. So it's parallel. Yeah, it's, ooh, yeah, ooh. <laughs> so think about pigeon. Yeah, it's two pigeons. It's both legs. And five, four, three, two, Oh man, roll your way up. I'm not doing that for your facts, it really feels good. And then swap <laughs> one in front, and again come to that nice parallel. Edges of the mat always a nice, nice way to measure. So resist the temptation to bring them in, that makes things easier. Keep them out, flex the foot, really flex the foot so the ankle, so the knee is safe. And then press the belly button forward. <laughs> press it forward. So basically, it's a four. It's a figure of four stretch. Yeah, and it's a two sides. More well than everybody. Five, four, three, two. Oh, roll our way up and extend the legs out. So we're gonna hit both a curved spine and a flat back. And then go to the curved one first. So sit up nice and tall. Move the jump out of the trunk. <laughs> Stop out of place. Lift up. If that's really, really challenging for you, just tip your body up, nice and tall, really sit up tall, and then send yourself forward, and then relax over your legs, doesn't matter where you are. And then scoop the navel to the spine, relax the head, neck and shoulders, everything down. Five, four, three, two, now let's try to hit the flat back so gently sit up. And this time, press the belly button forward without slunching back. So, so you're really pulling back. So like a, you're like a piece of paper, straight back, straight legs. Five, four, three, two. Nice one. Release and using your abs to roll up. And let's stretch out the toes to finish your final minute of class, guys. So all ten toes are on the floor. All ten toes, including a little one. And then pull right over. <laughs> if you've ever been to a yoga class, it's the very last minute, you're on the timer. We start the class with the crazy warm up for the feet. We'll end it with a nice stretch for the toes. I say nice. <laughs> it still hurts. It just, if you, the more you can you might try to relax into it, the more bearable. Seventeen seconds. Time flies. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, let me stop recording before you are mute. I can't. Thank you, Instagram. That's all from me this morning. I'm gonna switch off now. Thank you, guys. Bye.